watching Simulink tutorial and today we are going to see how to implement if else using script. So let's start. So as usual I am writing my script with basic commands like bd close all clear and clc and after that we are accepting a as an input from the command window. So to do that type a is equal to input in parenthesis in single quotes type the string that you prefer like enter the value of a or whatever is suitable for you so this is like scanf from c code so you can accept input from the command window then the main part which is the if else part so to do that write if and in parenthesis the condition you want to check so even if you don't write it in parenthesis it is completely fine so i have written the first if condition without parenthesis so i'm checking if a is equal to is equal to 1 if it is true then the logic that should be executed is y is equal to small true so small true has value of 1 in matlab 15 then else space if in parenthesis i'm checking if a is equal to is equal to 0 and if it is true then y is equal to small false which will have value of 0 and the statement is terminated and after that the else part so if it is not 1 not 0 if it is other than 1 or 0 then the value of a will be assigned to y and to end this if else type end so the number of times you use if those many times you have to write end so since i'm using it twice i have written end twice so once you are done with your if else part you can print your output so to do that you can use either f printf function or this function so like c in c we use printf to print values so here we are using f printf so f printf in parenthesis and in single code y is equal to since i am assigning numeric value to a so i am writing percent d if it is string you can write percent s and slash n so the next output or the string that you will display will be written on the next line and after the quotes comma y so the percent d will take value of y and terminate the statement with semicolon and to display the value of y using disk so to do that type disk in parenthesis in single quote y is equal to and terminate this part and after that disk in parenthesis just y so the difference between these two disks is that first disk takes y is equal to part as string since it is written in quotes and the second one which is without single quotes will take the actual value of y so if i run this script you can see in the command window enter the value of a i am assigning a 1 so the y is equal to 1 is displayed twice due to two different functions then again if i run this script so this time i am assigning a is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 the output again if I run the script, I'm assigning a the value 8, you can see y is equal to 8 is assigned, the values are displayed, so that's how we implement if else in MATLAB. So that's all for this video, if you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up and keep watching and keep learning, thank you.